Bill, so you're definitely wanting to uh, stay weather aware for Carb Day tomorrow. This, of course, will be the last practice day for the 33 drivers before the Indy 500 Sunday. Weather, as you know, plays a big role in the race. Personally, I would love to be hot. I think it would spread the field out a little bit. With the changes that IndyCar made, I think they're great. You're going to see more passing. Uh, but that's not gonna, what's going to happen. So being cooler, you're going to see, for the, for the fans, it's going to be a very, very awesome race because it's going to pack the field even more. So. All right, the gates are going to open tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock for Carb Day. Practice gets underway at 11 and runs until 1 o'clock. Well, Indy 500 driver Marco Andretti made a pit stop at White River State Park today to check out an impressive display of community pride. Tonight at 6, our Rich Nye explains what all the green flags are about and how they're helping feed Hoosiers here in central Indiana. Each one of these 500 flags carries an inspirational message written by someone in the Indianapolis community. And each flag represents a $40 donation from Mountain Dew to Gleaner's Food Bank. Marco Andretti drives for Gleaner's Food Bank in the Indy 500. The city of unwavering champions. Indianapolis. Marco walked through Celebration Plaza at White River State Park, a field of green flags waving the start of race weekend in a revived Indianapolis. The flags behind me not only represent the return of the Indy 500 and the start of the race weekend, but also to celebrate the resilience of the people of Indianapolis and the tremendous community that can only be found here. Indy rocks, keep our people fed. It's exactly what we've been doing the last year. 500 flags times $40 equals a $20,000 donation to Gleaner's Food Bank. The support is still strong. The need is still there. People are still building back. They're rebuilding. Um, it's going to take a while before all that's covered, but we're fortunate to be uh, in a place of such strong community support. The more we can, we can give, the more we can uh, feed people, and uh, no one runs on empty. Hope for Indiana is possible with a wave of support.